have painted glasses. That is so pretty. Do you like that one? Oh, I'm in Oh my gosh. Look, yeah. Look I'm very first It's a first age. Baby, we're children of summer. We're meant to be free. Honey, we're not like the other. No reason to be. Okay, you guys, I just peeked into the chicken coop. Wait, what? Oh, no! <laughs> we might have an egg. <laughs> Hurry! <laughs> Let's see. Let's let Junie grab it. Oh, shit, oh, shit. I see it right oh, up oh there. Oh, my God, it's oh, so exciting! Oh, oh, you want to see it? I can't see it. Can you grab it? Oh, yeah, we can change that. Do you see it in there? I don't know if you can grab can it. I Here, it pretty I'll, far. I'll pull it forward. <laughs> oh my god. <gasps> look, look, I'm very first. It's egg. a first egg. Okay, grab can you it. grab it? You have to hold on to it. Gentle, gentle. Oh, oh. oh. gentle. It's our first egg. Yummy. I'm so excited. They're going to start now. They're going to start laying. That is so exciting. Is that so cool? Yeah. Yay. Oh my goodness, it's good job. <laughs> Say good job chicken. Good job chicken. It. It's, it's gonna be fragile. yummy. It's fragile. Hold it gently. You Which wanna eat it? Girls did it. Is, you don't see any more? Uh -uh. I don't see it. Do you see any more? They'll start now, man. They're gonna start. I don't see. Eat it. Eat Should we egg. leave that one in there so they know to lay? Oh no, they'll lay. They'll just lay. Yeah, they will. You wanna eat the egg? You wanna eat the egg? Well, let's cook it up. We'll cook it up. I'm gonna eat it for breakfast. Okay, you guys eating the chicken's egg? Mm -hmm. I'm trying to do this thing. You wanna try it? I'm trying to grab it. <laughs> Just pull it. Here, Jenny. Here, let me try some. Try it. Avery, try it. I'm trying to use your fork. Is that yummy? Does it taste any different? Mm -mm. No. I think it does. I tried it. You tried it? It looks good. I want to try it. Mm. Mm, that egg was good. I cannot believe we got our first egg. They're still playing out there. Um, but we do need today, we are doing something monumental for our family. We are going to go back to school shopping. I. I can't believe that June is going to school this year. She just seems so young and I guess she's ready and we enrolled her and now we gotta go back to school shopping. It's just, I don't know. Sometimes I get emotional just thinking about it cause it's like, we just, I felt like we just had her. Like she was just a baby and now she's going off to preschool for the first time. So that means we gotta go get some supplies. I don't really know what supplies you need for preschool. Um, I should probably email her teacher, but um, I'm guessing like crayons. We're gonna we need she needs like a backpack or a bag, crayons, um, and she definitely needs a back to school outfit or a first day of school outfit, I should say. It's her first day ever. Um so we're really excited. We're gonna head over to Fred Meyer and go see what they have and get all of her back to school stuff. I'm so excited. Kels is excited. Um I don't know. It's just crazy to think about that she's going into school. It just every time I think about it, it just blows my mind and it's just how could my little baby be going to school? So sad, but also so happy because I know she is going to have a blast in school. I love school. Kelsey loves school. So I think June's going to like it. Are you shopping for your first day of school outfit? Oh no. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. So pretty dresses. That is so pretty. Do you like that one? Oh, I want to wear it. You want to wear it? This one. Oh, that's a good that's one. A good squeezable. One. You are squeezable, well, huh? This is pretty glam. I bet you would like the sparkles. Oh, that is so cute. I have one too. <laughs> oh, this one does have a lot of sparkles. <laughs> you are adorable. <laughs> okay, Levy, you want to pick your dress? Your back to school dress? We have four to pick. We got four options. Okay, which one do you want? Which one? Do you want this one? Which one do you I like? Want this Okay, look at them. Look go at all four. Go Which point. one do you like? Which one do you like? Did you find the one, lovey? Yeah. It is so pretty. Yeah. I love your choice. Yeah. That is so cute. 
You checking it out? Look at you, looking in the mirror. You are a cutie. You ready for first day of school? Can I get a thumbs up? Yeah, let's go. Look at my pretty dresses. It is so pretty, Lovey. I love it so much. Let me see your shoes. I don't even see your shoes. Oh my goodness, there's unicorns on there. Thank you. <laughs> I love you. You guys, we have so many plans and ideas for this backyard. I am so excited. Corbin and I were talking about it the other day of all of our plans of how we want to like keep the same vibe but kind of make it our own and renovate it, fix it up a little bit. There's definitely things that need fixing like the patio is falling apart. We're going to have to redo that. Um, but it's exciting. I love those sort of projects. And today, meanwhile, today we worked so hard this morning on the front yard so it ended up being pretty overcast cool morning which has not happened in a long time and we just worked and worked and worked I'm exhausted it's been a full day it's been really fun but it's been a full day my back is killing me um, but we got so much done so basically we're, kind of, we're not starting completely from fresh but we but we are definitely clearing out a bunch of stuff in the front um, and making it our own. So it's going to be a little bit empty at first because there's a lot of plants and stuff we're going to be clearing out. Uh, basically, what I wanted to do when we first moved into the, our house is um, see, like let things grow and see what was already here and then decide what we wanted to keep and what we didn't want to keep. And with the front yard, there's a lot of really cool stuff up there. <laughs> so a lot of it looks like native plants my, and stuff. My unicorn. And your unicorn? My unicorn. Um, but it's just kind of a little bit wild. And I want it to look a little bit more organized and maintained. And it's just the way that it is right now, it's just a lot of work to maintain. Um, and I just, we just don't have time for all of that work. So we're gonna make it a little bit low maintenance and then slowly build it over time. So we have a lot of clearing out to do, but we got a lot done. So we, there's like these garden beds we totally cleared out. They had like all kinds of different rocks in them. And then a few plants, we just pulled out the few plants that were there. They were pretty much dying anyways. Um, they were in full sun and they're not meant, the plants are not meant to be in full sun. And then we cleared out the rocks and uh, cleared out a bunch of weeds, cleared out some big bushes and all kinds of stuff. And we have more work to do, but it was fun. It was a lot of work, but really nice to, I can't wait to see what it looks like when it's, when it's put together. Whew. All right, you guys. Time for a workout. I just did some warming up, so I'm a little sweaty. But uh, I usually go to CrossFit early in the morning, every single day. This morning, I could not get out of bed. I know, I suck. I, it, I was just so tired, and I was like, I can't do it. But I was like, I need to do a workout. I try to work out six days a week. Um, and that is due to uh, a lot of the medical stuff that happened a while back. If you guys don't know, I was diagnosed with low testosterone and now I'm on testosterone replacement therapy and part of me trying to naturally boost it is through diet and exercise. So part of that is doing CrossFit. I've been doing CrossFit for probably four or five months now um, and I really like it. It's really awesome. I love that it's physically challenging. It's mentally challenging. Um, it gets you in shape. There's just a lot, a lot of positive about CrossFit. However, I didn't go to class today, so I thought I would show you guys kind of, well, I actually, my CrossFit gym has an app, and so I'm doing the workout for today. Luckily, I can kind of modify it and do it at home. Basically, what I'm gonna be doing is three rounds for time. It's gonna be a 600 meter run into 20, they say medicine ball cleans. I don't have a medicine ball, so I'm gonna do kettlebell cleans. Um, 20 of those, and then 20 box step overs. I also don't have a box, so I'm going to be do 20 lunges, because um, it kind of works the same muscle groups. So, that's what I'm gonna be doing tonight. Juni is asleep, and usually I either have to work out early in the morning before Juni wakes up, or right now when Juni is asleep. I guess I can also do it at nap time, but usually I'm working then. So, here we go, workout of the day. 
it's also like overcast but it's still 90 degrees so it is super hot and i'm just going to be working out in our backyard i've got my run planned down the back here's my kettlebell and then lunges in the grass here we go <laughs> A little hotter than I thought it was gonna be. I try to run once a week, so I didn't think it was gonna be that bad, but yeah, that was pretty bad. Whew. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of been my workout routine. Not that exact workout, but a CrossFit workout for six days, or five days a week, and then run at least three miles on the last day. Um, so yeah, I think I'm gonna end the video right there though. Um, beat, thumbs up if you liked today's video. Hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you guys in our next video. Be your feet.